When you're talking about Popper, there's really only one thing that has stayed consistent over the past about a year or two, probably. It's that artifacts are everywhere. That's the truth. I mean, take a look at this metagame page right now and, and just tell me I'm wrong because you have Burn that's playing Galvanic Blast. You have <laughs> Affinity, which is Affinity. Uh, Boros Synthesizers playing Rebirth, Galvanic. But look, everyone has their piece of the pie. Everyone wants a little bit of them artifact lands, except for maybe Bogles running enchantments. But that also means that every deck in the metagame has to have likely at least four to six slots in the sideboard, if not more, including the main board to answer this deck. They have to have something for this artifact engine. And this game actually is probably one of the best examples of why Gorilla Shaman is the GOAT. Gorilla Shaman go pew pew. Gorilla Shaman does so much. And I know hitting artifacts that are one, two, heck even three, if you get to that mana cost, are crazy, but it happens and it's really damn good. Enjoy. I think this is the first time this whole league that I've actually won the die roll. And uh well maybe maybe not i can't remember it's been a minute but uh this isn't good this isn't bad i am on the play though i'll, I'll try it. it it's like once it gets going it's kind of it kind of slaps but like that's a big once if <laughs> once it's sorry um yeah we'll play that we'll we'll, we'll we'll go ahead do our thing um I mean, next turn I hold up Galblast, which is something. It's not ideal. It seems like I might want to hold up Galblast. Basic planes. Yeah, so we'll play this. Hopefully we can draw a third land. That would be really nice. Hopefully that third land is red or something. I don't know. Depending on what they play, I may want to Galblast it. Ooh, okay. Mid range. Seek of the way. Okay. I think, I, I think I'm supposed to Gal Blast that. If they play a non-creature spell, so be it. Yeah, I think I'm supposed to Gal Blast that. Can't let them like get too crazy too early on. Come on, don't miss on the land here. Missed on the land. All right, cool. This hand is just gonna be pure gas. I mean, next turn, I think I'm forced to just Deadly Dispute, um, which isn't ideal. But if I Deadly Dispute, I find a land, I can at least play the Acre Wellspring because Deadly gives me the treasure. For Mirrodin! And Glenhawk. Probably return that. Oh. Oh, okay. You just create tokens. Okay, I like that. I like that. I like that. All right. We found the land. So I'm actually just going to go... Sack this. Yep. Just start drawing cards, honestly. It's definitely the way to do this. Play seat. Play the wellspring. Draw more cards. Yeah, like once I get there, like, okay, I have the car client shaman, truthfully. And, uh, dang. Dang, dang, dang. I'll drop the Reckoner's Bargain. Yeah, like I have the Kark Clan Shaman. And once that starts going, it's going to be pretty good. This, this, yo, this is actually kind of fire. Yo, hold on. Like, because you create like a Rebel and you just keep bouncing with Glenhog. That's kind of fire. That's kind of, that's kind of sweet. Hmm. It, it like it's it's funny because like it, it's like when it's on the battlefield it makes my uh it makes my KCS like easier. Yeah, you're you're gonna, you bounce the barbed. You bounce the barbed. So really, I mean, now that they play the two three, I was gonna say ne next turn I kind of just play Silver Bluff Bridge, play KCS, and then like go to town. But we'll see. That's fine. Take the damage. Maybe I find it on tap land. Okay, so like think about the math here. So I play Quark Clan Shaman. Uh I play Nihil Spell Bomb. I guess just to keep it on the battlefield. Uh yeah, so I think. Um, how do I do this? I guess I could do this either way. Like I could go Quark Clan Shaman top tap. Then it goes, I play Icker Wellspring. So one, 
two, three, four, five, six. Uh, I probably want an untapped land because I then I can play Enforcer, Enforcer. Yeah, and then I don't think Enforcers are going to die to all this. So let's go one. Two. Three. Okay, and then Mer Enforcer for one. I guess I could play the Nihil Spell Bomb, but like, do do I need to reveal that as well? Yeah, you know what? The optimal line is probably just play Nihil Spell Bomb and then go Enforce and Enforce. So you have more artifacts on the battlefield. Okay. Uh, regardless, though, regardless though, it's not it's not bad. It's 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 good right now. Like we we have a board. We're doing things. We understand what they're trying to do. Kind of like this is some type of Boros mid range Boros aggro. Um, they might be playing that that anthem effect that that has like flash uh, thing from the graveyard plus two plus so to all creatures like they might have that Icker. like I, I block pretty well here uh, they have three artifacts on the battlefield now so their gal blasts are a thing I'm pretty happy with just blowing things up, honestly. Uh, yeah, I mean, I'll take the four. It's not that deep. It might be, though. Like, they have Gal Blast, but I do have, like, one Reckoner's Bargain available to me, so. Like, they're not, they're not killing me this turn, right? Like, that's not, that's not the plan. And they can't play, like, the, the artifact they have in their hand until that happens, so. Perfect. More untapped lands is always a beautiful thing. Let's play in the hill spell bomb. Let's play the misfall bridge. Actually, probably should play silver uh, silver buff for like more red. Hmm. Okay. Pass through. Pass through. The real scary thing is here if they play red, if they play like a third red source, then they're like kind of just threatening lethal. But like I have the Reckoner's Bargain just in case. I'll just do this now, it's fine. Um, let's go one. And then two. Nice. And then three. Pay the block and draw card. Yes. Okay. <laughs> So a lot of a lot of cards I did not really want to draw, but okay. Wipe their board out. That's that's what I want to see really. Uh oh my god, right. This is creatures without flying, right? <sighs> it's creatures without flying. Okay, all right. All right, all right. Right, okay. All right, all right. That was that was the misplay on my part. Forgot. Like, I probably should have just attacked. Like, what are they going to do here? I might just Gal Blast one of these. It's probably, it's probably better, but... It's, get, it's getting to that point on the life totals. It's getting to that point on the life totals. Mm, I'll hold it. I'll hold it. Double Gal Blast kills me, but I have the Reckoner's Bargain. Yeah, KCS is KCS is weird here. KCS is weird here. I forgot the clause that it doesn't hit things with flying. I forgot the thing that it doesn't hit things with flying. I like I didn't need a sack the Nihil spell bomb. I could have just kept that a little bit, but Wait. Uh, 
Uh, yep. That we need to like counter, truthfully. For Mirrodin. Okay. Damage is gone. Kanku Artificer is pretty sweet. Okay, let's go with... Uh, let's play the Kanku. Right. It's actually funny. That's one way to kill this, actually. That is one way to kill this. I could just do that and kill it. That might actually be the move here. Actually, yeah, turn it into a creature. Turn it into a creature and then just kill it. it. Might just be the move. That's actually crazy. That's a line right there. That's a that's a that, that's a line. When this got highlighted, I was like, hmm. My spidey senses are tingling on that one. Alright. That's something. I actually should have played a land first because they could just go for it. There's so many misplays I'm uh, I, like that I'm doing this this whole turn. I don't have Reckoner's Bargain up. Like I, I'm making the mistakes. I'm, I'm making the mistakes. And they're thinking like, oh, do I go for it? And like they have uh, the counter spell up. Okay. All right. So that's done. Definitely hold up Reckoner's Bargain. Go to attacks. Mer Enforcer. I think it might be in my benefit to just do this now, truthfully. Because they only have they only have one red up. I don't want to get double gal blasted. I truthfully don't. Yeah, I, I, I truthfully don't. I'm also probably just getting hit for a bunch next turn. Hitting the batter fist, though. Kanku coming in, killing the batter fist. I got to figure out how to how to deal with these flyers without misplaying. But drawing these lands isn't great. Honestly, a, a blood fountain would be great here. Blood fountain gives me back KCS and Murn Forcer, which is something. But also, I might just chump with the Kenku, and then then and then I get Kenku back, and then I turn one of my indestructible. Uh, then I turn one of my indestructible lands into a creature, and I just keep swinging with it. That's like the level one play, right? Yeah, that's that's the level one play. Level two play. I honestly, I might be a level three, level four play. Like, yo, hitting the um, hitting that, and then turning into a creature. Kanku Artificer is Doomblade, truthfully. Kanku Artificer be acting like, not Doomblade. It's not Doomblade. It's not removal, but it, it, it's creating opportunities here. I'll, I'll actually, I'll actually block here with the Kanku. Prevent two damage. Yeah, that way a drawn blood fountain feels a little bit better. I don't think I necessarily want a KCS here. <laughs> All right, Galblast, Galblast isn't exactly winning the game. It does something, though. Yeah. See, this is what I was worried about. This is exactly what I was worried about. It's exactly what I was worried about. Now it's like, what do, what do I do? It's a little, it gets a little iffy here. Especially with draws like this. If I don't draw anything here, this is a loss. So let's go. Let's create black with this. We have enough blue. Ooh, that's a draw. That's a draw right there. Go to attacks. That's something. It, it's something. Like it's not. It's not saving me this game. 
Okay. Yeah, they don't want to get into the range of Galblast Galblast either. So to hit this, gain the life, go to 10. The Hill Spell Bomb is something, but Metallic Rebuke is also something. Metallic Rebuke is not much though. So I take six here, go back to four. Galblast exactly beats me. Galblast exactly beats me. I'm going to Hill Spell Bomb. It's it's not cute. I I don't know though. What was what was I supposed to do? Hold it back to block? It still does something, right? Like go and attack. Like they have to expect. Like I have all these cards in my hand. They don't know that it's lands. They don't know that it's lands. Come on. All right. They have one card in hand. What do you got for one card? Is it last card? Uh, no. I can't. I can't do anything. Like, what if they just draw the gal blast? I can't do anything. That's what I. That's what I have to be ready for. Yep. Take six. Go to four. Yep. Hold on in the hill. Yeah, this is... I don't know how we survive this. That's that's a start. That's a start. Uh, K, okay, KCS is something. It's another start. So let's play it. Let's play KCS. Let's play Chromatic Star. Um, let's hit them both here. So chromatic star hit for one, right? Wipe the board there and then, and then hit the Nihil. Get a black draw card. I'm drawing cards, but I'm not getting life. I'm not getting life or I'm not creating advantage here. Draw more cards. Okay. Like, I think like go Gal Blast, Gal Blast, and hold up, like, yeah, like hold a Metallic Rebuke, debt or like Gal Blast plus Deadly Dispute. I, I I don't know. I don't know. Like they'll go to combat, right? And then I can like kill whatever they equip with like four Mirrodin or something. This is so close. This is it's only game one. This is only game one. <sighs> okay. All right. You're drawing your cards. Yep. This is crazy. Okay. Yep. Yeah. This is so good. It's so good what they're doing. No, 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 damn it. No, they have the three. Oh, all right. Oh, uh, all right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't know how good Metallic Rebuke is going to be here, but Gorilla, Gorilla Shaman could do something. Um, Blue Elemental Blast, though, could be it, though. Yeah, I think we might drop, like, the Metallic Rebukes. Might not be, like, the most useful thing. Uh, makeshift Munitions feels fine. Uh, KCS feels okay, too. Um, the Nihil Spell Bombs don't feel as useful. So let's just go two for two. And then I... Uh, it's not exactly Affinity, but... They have Affinity stuff. Right, they have affinity stuff. So I could go like one here, drop a ginger brew. Mm. Maybe drop like one Kenku. Kenku Artificer kind of slaps though. Kind of does a lot for me here. I need I think I think I need at least two KCS. 
I think I need at least two KCS. So maybe maybe this isn't that deep. The Gorilla Shamans. Um, I could draw. Nah, could shave Blood Found. I could I could do it like that. Enough where I need it, but I don't. I don't think it's like desperate. But like, killing the artifact is is good. Is good. I'm gonna get to that mana. Yeah, killing killing that stuff is good. I don't think I necessarily want to negate a lot. That's not the type of battle I want to play. And then Chainer's Edict seems like in a deck playing Cold Dotha. It's like uh. I'll try it. You need a little bit of everything. You need a little bit of everything. Yeah, why not? This hand's like fine. I can play his Frogmite on too. Like I'll go Great Furnace Seat, Frogmite on two, hold up Thoughtcast. Um, maybe I get a one mana artifact. Are they mulling? I don't know. Like I have to. This hand's also good because I have to kind. I have to expect Gorilla Shaman, right? I have to expect Gorilla Shaman. So they kept a six. Great furnace pass. Yeah, I have to expect Shaman. So having a Gal Blast, I might lose a land, but you know, it's what it is. Do I just keep playing it slow? I think so. I don't I don't need to play frog by here. I'll hold this up. Cause I think like just getting down, like if they go Gorilla Shaman next turn, uh is brutal. It's brutal. It's brutal things. Okay. Set me back a turn. Nice little time walk. It's good. That's good. I like that little I like that little time walk you got there. I'll play this. Play things slow. Play things slow. Not in a rush. Not in a rush. Next turn go frog my pay one frog my and then thought cast is one. Yo, there's no way. Come on. Nah, this hand is insane. Yo, this hand is insane. Yo, the, okay, just just play this. Like there, yeah. At, at this point, like there's no there's no playing it slow. At this point, there's no playing it slow. My thought cast can cost two. Holy, yo, don't tell me you have an. Okay, I was gonna say, don't tell me you have another one. Like that's wild. I think I'm supposed to kill that. Yeah. Can't let that like start gaining life on me. They're, so they're waiting on land. They kept a two land hand to revoke. I, I don't exactly blame them, truthfully. Yeah, I don't exactly blame them. I would like a third land here because a third land lets me play Mur Enforcer. But a third land is also probably an artifact. Dot cast is one type of thing. Okay, all right. Okay, that reduces my artifact count. Yup. Take out Gal Blast. This is brutal. Like, actually, it's pretty brutal. Sawcast. All right. I, it's something. It's something. I still got Gal Blast up. I'm not drawing lands, but it's something. I have Acre Wellspring. If I can draw a land, I have Acre Wellspring plus Deadly Dispute next turn. Like, something. Sure. Right. Right. Or if I go land, I could go makeshift munitions. Oh no, I have to pay for it. Okay. Yep. Draw a card. Give me a land. Okay, four artifacts. Four artifacts on the battlefield. Next turn, hopefully we can go land, untap land, 
Acre Wellspring, five artifacts, uh, four on tap mana. We're playing Enforcer, Enforcer. Okay. Yeah, yeah, ball. My, my stuff's gone. My stuff's gone. My, my blood fountain is not going to work. Come on. You've double revoked me. Like, don't, don't make this hard on me. <laughs> don't make this hard on me. Don't make this hard on me. Sure. I think I got to gal blast one of these. I think I got to gal blast it. Get it gone. Okay. Uh, hey, yo. Okay. I think what we'll do is actually just play the makeshift munitions just to like threaten that, right? Like next turn, I'm going to ping that down, play the chromatic star. Um, we're at five, right? And then next turn, we could be at six, play Icker, play one for Mer Enforcer. I, I really just hoping to draw that land. That puts me ahead a little bit because makeshift munitions cost cost mana. I, I think actually I have to use that mana to ping, truthfully. Okay, mountain. That's good though. Another one. Okay. Yep, take the three. This is gonna be this is gonna be a grindy one. This is gonna be a grindy one. Okay. All right. On. Oh, okay. All right. Um. Okay. Play this. Give me a land. Come on. Give me a land. Give me a land. Even tapped works here. Truthfully, there is no way. Okay. All right. Um. I think I'm supposed to here. Ping this. Right? Ping this down. Okay, all right. There's the there's the land. Enforcer costs one. Free enforcer. Okay. I have a board presence. Okay. All right. I have a board presence. They don't exactly, but I mean, double relic, like they're, they'll draw into something. They'll start like, you know, their, their barbed batter fist will, will come back, but they do have to like unequip them. They do have to like unequip them. Yeah. There you go. There it is. There it is. Yep. Oh, interesting. Okay, so I are they just gonna like hard equip into that, I guess? That's probably pretty smart too. Like equipping both the batter fists into this. Nah, come on. Yo! How many of these do they have? Yo! Stop! It's been like the top 20 cards! Top 20 cards, all three? Nah. What? Yo. Yeah, all right. Okay. I, 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 at least it's makeshift munitions. That's not great. It's not great. Like taking makeshift munitions is not, is not great. But. Bet. All right. Fox. All right. If they go to like bounce one of these, I'll, I'll kill it. Fox. All right. I'll take it for what it is. Um, let's go to combat. Let's attack. I got to start getting in their face. Yeah, like I got to start getting in their face. Double enforces, two four fours. Pretty good. Pretty good, turns out. Yeah. Pretty good, turns out. All right, uh, let's go one two showing that i don't have any red spells i have deadly dispute and a blue elemental blast which i can i can do both right but it has to be specifically deadly and and blue okay we are about to find probably like the biggest clump of lands in in, in some way i 
think I counter that to keep the pressure. Let's go deadly first. Because I want to be I want to be able to do all of this. Let's go deadly first. I want to counter this lightning bolt. Because I, I do think I do think that the four fours are valuable here. Counter that. For blue. Yeah. I do think they're valuable. Yeah. Like next turn, they can do all this, right? They can do a bunch next turn, but even still. Yeah, whatever. <laughs> Let me think here. Uh, so hopefully they don't just draw one of their, their tap things because then they, they almost just refigure their board here. They might. Yeah. It's two relics. Oh my god. I mean, they're trying. I'll, I'll give it to them. They have had, like, yo, they've drawn a lot. And they've just been, like, doing their best to answer my stuff. They have just been trying their... And you know what? They haven't been drawing... I don't want to say they haven't been drawing good, though. Because that's just, like, disingenuous. Like, they have been, like, really... They have slowed me down. Like, significantly. But eventually you get there eventually you get there yeah there you go um let's go to combat first the other blue elemental blast yeah i think i think the blue elemental blast here are like it, it's a good call i think they're a good call yep and they can't exactly cast the blue uh, they can't exactly put the bar batter fist onto these because they'll kill them which is nice. Um, yeah, worst case scenario, if they if they go to kill my other Mer Enforcer, I can just like sack it. It's not ideal. Uh, I do want to counter this, but I, th I think I have to though. I, th I think I have to. I, I think I'm better suited for combat than I am like dealing with this type of guy. Like if they're drawing bad, they're drawing bad. I have to keep them drawing bad, truthfully. I have to keep them drawing bad. Yeah, they're not attacking at all. Uh, Deadly Dispute. KCS, maybe? Gorilla Shaman, not bad, actually. Shaman's not bad. They start, like, sniping down their stuff. Shaman's actually not bad. Go attack. Yep. They might like double block and kill Frogmite. Yeah, okay. Bet. Bet. I'm here for it. Yeah. I'm here for it. That's the that's the type of exchange I want. Cre keep creatures off the battlefield. I'm here for that. Truthfully, let's go Gorilla Shaman. Let's hit the ancient then. They won. Let's hit. Actually, let's hit these. How much do these cost? These cost mana value X. I need uh, two, two, one. I need six mana just for one of those. Okay, so maybe, maybe we'll hit those slowly. I do have like exactly six, but we should calm down. <laughs> like, maybe it's not that serious. Yeah, like next turn, I can start spending all of my mana just to kill one of these, which is which is not like it's not a, a great thing, but it's some it, it's good. It's good. Sure, like that costs. I have exactly enough to kill that. They play Swift Spear in this deck. This is a really cool like hybrid deck. This is a really cool like hybrid deck. End of end of turn, you may play that card until the end of turn. Until end of turn. Okay, so I can I can like exile that here. Maybe just hit this. I need three. Hit this now, and then if it's like yeah, if it's like a land, they lose access to it type of thing. 
yeah they can't play that now perfect so that's that's gone nice easy snipe easy snipe now at this point one two three so i can still do this that's crazy yeah so what i'm gonna do hit this one two three four five six hit that I could have tapped this better. I could have. I uh, well, I mean, I have the treasure token. It's not that deep. Um, yeah. So let's go. Let's hold up deadly dispute and the blue elemental blast. Let's go to attacks. So they have one artifact. Their gal blast are doing two. That's what we want. They're really trying to grind this out. I, I would have conceded by now. Like the active gorilla shaman that they cannot kill. I have a blue elemental blast up. They don't know that, to be fair, but I don't know if this is a winning position for them. Yeah, I don't know if this is a winning position for them. I'm just going to keep attacking, truthfully. Yeah, there you go. So kill this. Two, three, four. Yeah, and then play the silver bluff bridge. Go to combat, attack with boats. So now they have no artifacts. They have none of those barred ba um, batter fists. I imagine they have gorilla shamans and they just didn't find them. So. Whatever like red thing they play here. Okay. They have to return something. Yeah. Um, I don't want to gal blast just yet. <laughs> okay, going for combat. <laughs> yep. Yep, gal blast you. GG's. All right. Sideboarding. Uh, I think we run it back. Like, truthfully, Blue Elemental Blast? All-star. All-star there. Um, I'm happy about shaving the Blood Fountain because we're not, like, too deep into it. If they're, they don't care about their graveyard, so Nihil Spellbond's fine. Again, I think 2KCS, pretty necessary, uh, along with the makeshift munitions. I think what we did was fine. Kenku might be a little too cute at this point. It might be, but I, and I still don't want um i still don't want chainer's edict so i think we run it like that yeah gorilla shaman was kind of hot though so having having gorilla shaman that was kind of hot though uh we have gorilla shaman we don't have a way to cast it it's an interesting hand i don't think it's the hand we go with though it's like very slow. Uh, show game log. They're mulliganing. We can mulligan too. We can find a better hand. This isn't a better hand. That first hand was not good. They're going to mulligan. We're going to mulligan. Oh, okay. All right. I like this. I like this. Okay. So we can drop Mer Enforcer and Reckoner's Bargain. We're going to keep this drop Enforce Enforcer Reckoner's Bargain. Um, we do get hit by the Exile. They're mulliganing hard though. Mulligan of four that's hard they're just not finding something playable they're trying to find hate probably like asap they're, they're they're looking at themselves saying like if i don't find hate i don't find nothing okay okay all right uh i don't um, i kind of i kind of have to expose my red source i, I really do want to play gorilla shaman next turn if, and if they have the exile effect, so be it. I mean, they mul they multi four for it. So use your resources. Yeah, they multi four for it if they have it. Yeah. All right. Fine. I have to force them to have it on a multi four. Come on, like that's my best bet right there. Now I can't play shaman, but it's fine. Double revoke? They mulled for double revoke? Okay. All right. All right. <laughs> nah, this is hilarious. This is hilarious. They, they mulled a four for a double revoke. 
It was like, it was probably two lands. It was probably two lands in the revoke. It was two lands and two revokes. Like, let's let's be real. Let's be real here. Uh, bet. Bet. I'll play this game with you. I'll play this game with you. If you have the answer to this, all right, all right, all right, fine, fine. All right, all right. That's cool. That's cool with me too. That's cool with me too. Like, there's no way. Nah, there's no way. Yo. <laughs> no, I think this is actually one of the funniest matches I've ever played. This is hilarious. And I just have gas, 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 gas. So I have to hope they stumble for like two more turns. If they stumble for like two more turns, I win. Bet. This is amazing. Okay, let's go Icker Wellspring because then I can use that to play Frogmite for free. Okay, Frogmite. Five artifacts. Next turn I can cast... Uh, I can cast the Mer Enforcer. I do have Gal Blast though too. So if they... You know, they're, they're top decking. So if they play a creature, hopefully they just don't find like the... thing with the Samurai Sword. Forgetting, forgetting the name of it. The, the one red artifact, but... Let's see. Okay, perfect. Using Gal Blast on my Frog Mites. It's good though. It's good though. Bad. Play it again. I'm gonna take your artifacts. Give me them. Let me tell you, if I draw like, yo, if I draw a Deadly Dispute, come on. It's about to get, it's about to get brazy if I draw, if I draw a Deadly Dispute. Yo, they just gotta pop it. They just gotta pop it. They're drawing nothing though. They are literally drawing nothing. Nah, let's go. <laughs> Yo, let's go. Blue elemental blast is crazy. Alright, but I can't I can't like cast it though. It's fine. Um let's hit that. Hold up, hold up, gal blast. Now they now they have three artifacts, but look, I'm not drawing land. Let me tell you. Let me tell you what I'm gonna do if I find a blue source. Let me tell you what I'm gonna do if I even find one more land. Let me tell you what I'm gonna do. Okay? <laughs> Let me tell you what I'm gonna do. Oh Lord, all the misplays in that first game. A little bit of luck on this one, so I, I will take it for what it is. Affinity doing affinity things. So uh that sucks but yeah that's fine that's fine again they are they are like just again just straight stumbling they are just straight stumbling here reckoner's bargain is freaking hot let's go uh let's go to combat first That's Reckoner's Bargain, because I need to draw cards. Right? That is absolutely wild that I'm drawing nothing. I think I have to drop Blood Fountain. Or, uh, I need a threat. I think I have to drop Blood Fountain here. Because Thought Cast gets me back into it. Blue Elemental Blast is actually pretty vital. Gal Blast is important in case... All this is important. I might maybe Reckoner's Bargain is the drop. Because this actually gives me this creates a blood token. And this creates an artifact too. That I can sack. So I think it's Reckoner's Bargain, actually. Yeah. So this is getting kind of iffy. Like, okay, so they drew another land, which is great that I can destroy, but it's getting kind of iffy. Okay, yo, this is getting ridiculous. This is actually getting ridiculous. Okay, how about we play two artifacts? Get those out, right? Two artifacts on the battlefield. Go to combat. Keep it slow. It's fine. What's not fine is like... I need a blue source. I need a blue source. It's getting crazy. I need a blue source. Okay, that's a Gal Blast target. Easy. Yeah, that's a Gal Blast target easy. That's fine. Y you keep that in your hand. You keep that in your hand. I'm going to hit that. You 
you keep that in your hand. I'm a deadly dispute. Hit this. Create a... This is crazy. I'm pretty sure I'm supposed to thought cast here. I am in a weird situation. I am going to drop Kenku though. So I'm going to hold up the blue elemental blast. I'm not going to thought cast. I'm going to hold up the blue elemental blast. So they played another mountain. Okay. That's funny. Play chromatic star. I'm at one, two, three, four, five. Go to attacks. Next turn I play Enforcer. Still hold up blue elemental blast. Cause I, I know it's in their hand. It's that it's the white artifact land. I know it's in their hand. That's fine. I'll pop it. Why not? Okay, go to combat. <clears throat> I'll attack. Mer Enforcer. Hold up blue elemental blast. Deadly dispute. Give me like access to the color is huge. I don't want to burn it with thought cast. I don't want to burn it with thought cast because they'll play something red. Yeah, like this that I need a counter. Blue. Yeah. <clears throat> yeah, I'll play something like that that I need a counter. Now I need to deadly dispute again. That's huge. That's actually massive. That's insane. Drawing that, drawing that like that. Okay, I, I I gotta count my luck while I have it, I guess. Mm, I don't need to do anything crazy right now. They're at they're at three. They're at three. They're on they're on the back burner. They need they need to draw something here. They're on the back burner. And we win this. Come on. Come on. We win this. We win this. Come on. Opponent. I have lethal on the board. Bet. Let's go. Let's go. All right. It was a 2-3 league. We did what we could, but we got the wins. GG's. Affinity doing affinity things. Woo. Okay. All right. All right.